right, it feels like we are just about at the summit of Stone Mountain. That's what this sign we're about to come to says. I don't know if we'll be able to get to a point from this summit, but down in the valley between Stone Mountain and Wolf Rock is the Hutchinson Homestead, established, I think, around 1859, somewhere in the 1850s, run by the Hutchinson family and their children and their children's children until, I believe, the 1960s, give or take, when North Carolina acquired this land for the park system. Yeah, there you go. Woo, yeah, this gets a little steeper there. There we go, all right. <laughs> and there's the part of the homestead down in the middle of that valley there, maybe about the center third. We'll be there in a, a little bit, a few more miles. All right, well, down was one thing. <laughs> now, it's back up, so that'll be fun. Yeah, that's the workout. Okay. Go down there and come back up. <laughs> no. No. I would not be so fortunate. It would be, you'd go down, there would be no coming back. We're on the Wolf Creek Trail that's also part of the Mountains to Sea Trail with a plane flying overhead. Should be pretty close to Wolf Rock. Did I say Wolf Creek? I meant Wolf Rock. I can't remember. Yeah, this flat stretch is a nice break from some of the more aggressive elevation gain we've been climbing over the last couple of miles. It hasn't been all straight up, but this is nice. Nice little break. And I don't know how far this stretch goes. I mean, we can clearly see trees up ahead. But I'm not sure what the view will be. I mean, and just to be sure, I mean, this, this is impressive. Beautiful just to see these kind of rolling hills, especially with that kind of low cloud cover. It sounds like the crows don't appreciate my intrusion. I uh, can't blame them. Yeah, 
you can see out over all of this. Just amazing. All right, so we're coming down onto Cedar Rock here. Got a good view of, I don't know if that's Stone Mountain or not, but that makes the most sense. Ooh, it's a little bit of water makes it a little slick. Large portions of this trail, whether it's Stone Mountain or Wolf Rock or Cedar Rock, almost seem paved with these giant uh, exposed sections of granite pluton. It's really pretty neat. We are just about entering the Hutchinson Homestead. You can see uh, it's like lots of people enjoying the grounds, taking a break. Clouds seem to have parted. We've got some sun today, which is nice. Wasn't expecting that, but I appreciate it. Of course, I uh, should have brought my sunglasses. Now I do know, and some of the signage uh, indicates as much, but uh, not all of these buildings are original. Some have been moved from other places in North Carolina uh, that are representative of the time period in which the Hutchinsons homesteaded this portion of land. Again, I believe that was back in uh, 1859, give or take. There we go. I'll turn around so we get a little bit of a clearer shot. But here, we're looking up at Stone Mountain, where we were before. Hey, oh, hey. All right, we are back on the uh, Stone Mountain Loop. We've come uh, back out from the uh, Hutchinson Homestead a while ago. Just working our way toward uh, Stone Mountain Falls. We were gonna check out the uh, Middle and Lower Falls, but because of time, we're not able to do that. So we'll keep uh, heading on until we hit the Stone Mountain Falls. I'll tell you what, walking up the face of Stone Mountain for that part was rough on the quads. These stairs are not a whole lot better. And there are a lot of them. Yeah, I think I left what was left of my stamina back. I don't, I don't even know. A couple hundred stairs ago. So when we started the loop, we walked past this chimney and this old hearth. 
And at the time, we went down that side. And now, having completed the rest of the loop after the uh, wolf rock and cedar rock uh, diversion, we are headed back to the parking lot. So, nice, nice day hike. Punishing on those stairs, but there's no reason why you have to sprint up them. Take your time. Plenty of seats along the, all the way and some of the landings, nice benches. Uh, pretty nice. So, anyway, the rest of this is just a walk back to the parking lot. You've already seen that. So I appreciate you checking out this hike and I hope to see you again in the future.